What's up, everybody? It's Brandon here from Something Face FX. Just wanted to give a quick update. Uh, I got a little bit more done on this sculpt. Um, started doing a little bit of texturing. And I use <clears throat> this like rake tool thing. I don't know if I Amazon. I don't know what the rest of them are, but pretty much getting the basic form and that done bone structure the teeth I'm gonna make molds of and do the individual teeth and when I cast this uh, mask it'll be easier I can just silicone them in after the rest of it is done curing just make things a lot easier not to worry about air bubbles in the mold uh, yeah and I want to <clears throat> kind of show everyone what I use for my sculpting uh, pretty basic got a couple paint brushes that I bunched together with rubber bands and I uh, use that for like texture and then the, the sculpting and stuff I bought this on Amazon it's actually a wax carving kit and it comes with a bunch of pieces and it's like plastic sheath to keep them in but I don't really use that uh, I think it was under 10 bucks or pretty close to uh, and they're all all stainless steel or galvanized maybe I don't know it hasn't rusted yet so <laughs> but yeah and then here's some of the silicone prosthetics that I make and sell on my website um, some of these were just practice ones that I had painted and a couple of these are uh, for customers some slash wounds and uh, the silicone that I use it's all platinum silicone uh, it doesn't have any deadener in it. This is like the softest you can get. Uh, it makes it super lifelike and I mean, it's kind of hard to tell on camera, but, but yeah, silicone is, that's the future. I mean, a lot of people are, are allergic to latex and everything I use is medical grade. So you know, some cheap brushes, kind of crappy. If anyone has any suggestions on good brushes to use for cream makeup, uh, preferably, you know, a little inexpensive as possible. But, yeah, hopefully when it gets a little warmer out, I can go to, to my shop and do some better videos there with all the other molds. And this is a crowbar. I uh, have a mold that I made. This is foam. Looks pretty realistic. And I spray the paint right in the mold. And then pour the foam in and it comes out just like that. I have like some metal powder and stuff too that I can make it look like like the metal. The paint's chipping and stuff. But uh, yeah, soft enough where you can hit an actor in the head and not hurt anybody. Um, yeah, so hopefully I can get some more done on this. Uh, Make the mold and get some masks going. Talk to you later, guys.